Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video and this is a video that will help you, hopefully help you out with figuring out an awesome base location for PVE over on Genesis 1. One of the hardest bases, I guess places to make a base on any of the ARC maps. I'm gonna go through 10 awesome base locations in all of the biomes and this should help you out a ton. At least I think it will. Now, if you don't mind, leave a like uh, if you want to say something below, leave a comment. That would be awesome. And if it's helping you out, make sure you subscribe to the channel. That would be awesome as well. So thank you very much. So let's start off with spot number one. Obviously, you can see we are at one of the most popular things to look at, but people don't usually know how to build on them. 34 or 37.4 and 71.7. Now, on top of this giant metal structure, you can actually build on it if you use a cliff platform. And then all you have to do is put some foundations off the end of it, and it allows you to build on any structure in the game. Now, that being said, this is actually really useful because if you can build here, it's a huge area, completely safe from anything that could possibly come after you. And uh, yeah, it's it's just a cool base location to have, especially in PVE when you're looking for some awesome base locations. This is what you're looking for. Big amount of space. This one doesn't quite have access to all of the... Uh, different resources that you might look for however it's got access to a really cool spot which is really important in pve because like look at that background over there i don't know i find that pretty cool so that's base spot number one now base spot number two um this is a kind of i mean i would call it similar ish kind of concept where we're trying to get up and away from everything um but it's one of those things that can be taken for granted because once you're up high just like you can see on this base location right here I'll go ahead and show you the cords 42.4, 48.3, and there's it on the map, just so you can see. Uh, this right here is one of my favorite spots to build on any arc because it's so high up for PvP, it's amazing. For PvE, it's also pretty awesome because you have this monster structure right here. Now, this is a huge flat area. Again, the hard part is gonna be getting up to this, but there's a lot of ability to build up here because of how high up it is. Nothing dangerous spawns on this entire section. You are in one of my favorite biomes, so if you are able to get some decent teleporting abilities, you can figure out how to get up to this very easily. That's a weird looking Pelagornis. He seems confused. Um, but there's plenty of resources nearby. Obviously, this map is latent with them, so uh, traveling resource-wise is never a problem. You just want to be able to find a good place to build. So this, this uh, Sky Tower, if you want to call it that, is probably one of the best. So that is my personal opinion. So let's move on to spot number three. Another, we're, we're keeping with that same concept with large amount of space. And that large amount of space, just like you see right here, inside of the ocean biome again, we are underneath in one of like the, the air chambers under the ocean. I love building in these. This one's my personal favorite just because of the stuff that you can actually get access to here. So I want you to kind of like look around. This is a massive chamber down here. Now you can clear it out pretty well. And then being able to just like go into this this uh, water by just flopping into it is pretty cool. I think that's one of those unique things that gives you a real want and will to play. That's my personal opinion, so keep that in mind. Um, but it, I just think it's a cool thing with plenty of space that's safe. Nothing spawns down here. I've never seen anything spawn down here, at least. Uh, so that is really, really helpful, obviously. So you got to keep that in mind. So obviously, great spot to build. You don't have to build here, but I think it's awesome. Now, number four, again, I want you to think that th this video is all about finding massive base spots with potential. Um, and that's very hard to find on this map just due to the fact that it's uh, difficult to build here. And this is one of my favorite spots on this entire map for two reasons. One, huge flat zone. You can see this right here, massive flat area on top of this. You can build on it and it's out of a zone for anything that could actually like you know destroy you there's nothing that spawns up here uh there's no missions up here so this is a awesome location so how do you get here pretty simple actually chords 83.5 60.5 and uh, that's where it is kind of like the bottom left corner pretty easy to access too because you can kind of run up this and uh, it's tons of space now the one negative thing obviously living in the bog you got the death swarms and i hate them with a burning passion but so does everybody um, and basically what we have right here is just a nice little zone that you can safely have. There's nothing that spawns up here. It's like no trees, no, no dinos, nothing. So it's pretty safe when you consider anything in Gen 1 because everything is so difficult to uh, acquire a safe spot. This is pretty unique with that. So that's spot number four. Pretty, pretty easy to 
understand that one just because it's got a ton of capability. Now spot number five, very similar. We're inside of the same zone here. So just so you can see 82.6, 83.5, and uh, that is in the lower right corner instead. This is another one of those zones that you've got a massive underground chamber. Um, this one right here, I like this. It can, things can fall down from right here. So I like to put a cliff platform up in this zone and kind of like block off this top spot but if you can do that this underground is very very safe because you can build some uh, foundations up and running and it's a very nice place to be able to build lots of room and uh, because in a swamp biome it's very difficult to find the um, safe places this is one of the best places you can be because the swarm also don't spawn down here you have to accidentally aggro one down here so that makes it very very nice for the purpose of quite literally being safe which is very hard on this map I know I keep saying that, but it really is. Um, so this is like one of the best ones, in my opinion, um, to be able to get that access to a safe place, especially in the uh, bog biome. Now, this next zone is another one of those zones that's pretty awesome. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you right now because, again, it's one of those things that like on this map, you're not really looking for like massive swaths of land. You're looking for swaths of land that are safe. Um, now, this is one of the hardest biomes to build. You can build in the caves technically, but it blocks a lot of missions. There is an area that is usually sheltered by the sun. Now, because you have this mountain over the top and this right here, you have coverage from the direct sunlight, which will block you from burning if you can actually build here. Now, this is a massive area of land. Um, again, the negative of building in this zone, however, is the fact that you have to, in this zone, again, um, you can't really do anything because you kind of float off into space. So this is more of like a small, if you have to build something, it has to be outside the cave. This is one of the best places you can go because there's no missions nearby and you've got a, uh, a lot of a room here that is flat. Now, obviously on most servers, this isn't really accomplishable. I would much rather just build in one of the caves in the lunar biome if you really want to build here. But if you can't, this is a pretty good coverage zone right here where you can kind of like build tucked up next to these rocks to avoid some of that damage. And uh, again, this is not the not my favorite, but we're just talking about where is the possible safest place in this area. If you can't build in a cave, this is up there. Now, I don't like building in this zone, but I had to try and include at least one. Um, and this is kind of where I'm at with this one. I'll show you what I mean by that. So right here, uh, eventually it's going to load in. So this is probably the safest place in all of this map to build. You've got a massive flat block here. Okay. Now this massive flat block, again, you can't use it for any purpose of building directly on top of it. But if you get yourself a cliff platform, like you see right here, you can build on top of this. Actually, you grab some, uh, some foundations build off of the clip platform onto this guy and you have a massive space now you do have to get up to this which can be difficult um, and that, that's probably the hardest part of this entire thing but the cords just so you have them 73.3 15.6 and then just so you can see it right here as well uh, this is the map for you and this is probably the safest zone in this area because the rest of this there's UDs, there's wolves there's all kinds of dangerous stuff however this right here this is great because you've got safety, nothing spawns up here. You've got massive area, cool. And uh, you've got protection from a lot of the environments because all those clouds and stuff don't hit up here. So you've kind of got protection from being able to not see things, which sucks on this server, um, on, on Genesis specifically. And uh, this is probably one of my favorite spots. So let's go ahead and go to the next spot right here um, because obviously there's plenty of places to build, but that's entirely up to you. So we're gonna go ahead and zoom in and uh, go to this next spot here and this is another one of those things massive flat area and uh, this flat area you can see it right here uh pretty big again you can build on this there's no special thing that you need to build on this area it is a little bit lower so you will suffer ice storms you see i'm like in the clouds right now um, but when it comes to this map this is one of the my i don't know one of my preferred spots to actually go because you can hit this pretty easily and again there's the cords for you um, but you've got a massive space right here, so you can build up here with plenty of room uh, if you want to build in the snow biome. I prefer not to build in the snow biome, but if you wanted to, this is probably the one of the best places that you can actually go for it. So right here, this is what's up if you want to build in the snow biome. These two massive areas are things that will help you out a ton, obviously, um, but there are safer places to build outside of the snow biome. But again, if you like snow, there you go. There's two different places you can actually go. So. 
the next base location we have back into my favorite zone. This is probably my favorite base spot, on, base spot on the entire map. Now, the reason is you're in a corner. So for PVP, it's probably it's, it's one of the more safe spots because you can kind of like build up and defend yourself because it's pretty hard to get above or nearby you. Um, and you can see me right here, 14.1, 61.4. And there's the map for you. Um, and just so you can see, you can also drop down beneath. So this area is actually massive. There's nothing up here that is dangerous. I like this one a lot, but for PVE, the lower spot is actually quite a bit better um, down here because you have a massive swath of land. And uh, yep, just like you can see right here, uh, lots of room and you kind of have an even lower drop point if you really wanted to be closer to the water here. But because you're in the corner of the map, you have a lot of safety. And especially if you can put down a couple foundations and stuff, um, you can section off a very nice amount of anything you want in this entire section. It's huge. So this is probably my favorite spot on any map um, for just building generic PVE stuff because it's a lot of fun. And I like this, uh, this setup in general, so it's pretty useful. So anyways, that is probably one of my favorite spots. Now, here's the last spot I have for you guys. Another one that is uh, hopefully useful for you because it's a little bit difficult to get to. Um, this one, again, we're in the, another again, uh, the ocean biome. See how I was talking about that tall, you know, invincibly high cliff earlier. However, you can go down beneath it and on this little ledge right here, um, you can build a very nice base. No missions are nearby and you've got pretty easy access to water. So you could build a little bridge right going straight down. And if you really wanted to, you could take over this island too. Um, both of these are kind of like my last little hurrah if you want to call it that because these are like two very nice islands close to water um just like you can see right here you have nice and easy access to the water on this side build a ladder right over here and it's another great spot to build um, these are both great base locations and again i'll show you those chords 40.5 57.6 and there you go there's a little spinny on the map for you um, and you can see plenty of room on this area with the deep ocean nearby so you can build down in there and have some water tames as well so anyways, hopefully this video helps you out finding a couple of PVE base locations over on Genesis 1, which is one of the hardest maps to find a good base spot for. And uh, hopefully it helps you out. If you haven't already smacked that like button, leave a comment below. Or if you really want to be awesome, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. It helps out a ton. So it helps me out and I hope I can help you out as well. All right. Hopefully it helps. Teach out.